there. Oh, hey guys, come on in. Here we go. So, welcome to our bathroom. <laughs> come on, guys. Welcome to our bathroom. Actually, in this house, because this is Grant's house, they actually have three bathrooms. So we only use the two of them because the other one is in the master's bedroom that we don't, you know, virtually use because that's their own bathroom. But yeah, so there's one bathroom and this bathroom is the one that is downstairs. And the other one, I'll show it to you later. But since we are here now, let me show you my first favorite closet or what do you call it? Cabinet that I want to show you guys and I am also excited about. Okay, so as you enter the bathroom, this is the door and this is the first closet that you will see which is my favorite part of this bathroom because this is where all of my makeup and skincare are so ah! so as you can see this white uh, what do you call it drawers is I bought it from Walmart I bought it for 11 or 12 dollars but what I did is put all of my makeups here so this is where all of the contours and the eyeshadows are that's how I separate them. I actually need one more, you know, but I don't have that much makeup, so I don't think I will be needing another one. So this is where I put all the mascaras, all of the highlighters, all of the blush on at the back, as you can see, and all of my eyebrows uh, tint. Here we go. I'm just gonna change it down. So on this first one, these are all the eye brushes and the highlighter brushes that are kind of dirty. I haven't cleaned them. And then this one are all for the face, like contour, blush, and face powder, and also liquid foundation. And then this is where I keep my, what do you call this, sponge. And then I don't know where to put this, so I just put it in there. And then this is Anthony's little section. So this is where his shavers are. What is this? Deodorant, and then his face cream and perfume. And then this is my messy kind of skincare little thing, if you guys can see it. So this is the skincare, the, the pads, I don't, because I don't know where to put them, you know. So I just put them all there. Don't judge me, please. I know that you're judging me. Stop, okay? I'm gonna clean it soon, please. <laughs> and then this is, what is this? Just the samples that I get from the store. And mostly, these are the stuff from the ordinary that I don't use anymore because I break out. But I don't know if I should show them or if someone wants them, comment down below. I'll send it to you guys. And then just baby oil, travel lotion, and coach leather cleaner. Can you guys see it? And then just lotions and then makeup remover. That's all. And then... When you go under here, this is where all of the extra stuff are. Where we have the face wash, face wash, what is that? Face wash, all the floss, uh, shampoos, conditioner, body wash are extras. So we just start in there. And then at the very bottom are all of the toilet papers and paper napkins. And also, I still have a bunch of stuff from the Philippines. These are the shampoos that are from the Philippines. And conditioners, look at that. I mean, I don't know where to use them. And then here are all of the towels that we use. And I don't know what is that if you guys can see it so as you enter the door this is the first thing that you will see so currently right now i am facing the door and this is the shower towel actually they, uh, they do like color coding here so all most not all but most of the designs are just white and gray you know so this towel this is the toilet i don't know if you guys can see it i'll just push there we go. So on the other side, we have the toilet and the sink, which is really nice. So what I usually do is put all of our main necessity or main, what do you call it? I don't know. Don't judge me, guys. <laughs> so this is where we put all of our toothbrush and then the Listerine for the mouthwash. You gotta have the fresh grass and cleanser, which is not supposed to be on the sink. I usually keep them here at the back where all of my skincare products are. Their co, our dental floss, and toothpaste is the only thing that is allowed in the sink, okay? And of course, you gotta wash your hand. And cotton bags, or they call it gidget. And if you are in real bathroom, there's always something like this. Okay, I need one. We need to be clean here, huh? Then, these are just all skincare products basically. It's kind of messy, so I'm kind of like trying to show you guys. And these are all the medicines 
this first two and then my perfume. By the way guys, this is where I put all of our hair products. This is the dry shampoo, the uh, stronghold and scented sprayer. <laughs> this is where all my curlers, my brushes and all of that stuff. Then these are just like cleaning stuff. Let's now go to the shower which is, I don't know if you guys will find something there. Okay, so this is the shower curtain. We do that. <laughs> okay, so Anthony is using this Axe Dark Temptation, which I also like. I like using this. I don't know, but I think it's really cool if you smell like Axe. I mean, I don't know if it's bad if the girl used like the men products, but I like it. So since we are talking about bathroom stuff, this is something that I will highly recommend for you guys to buy, especially if it's winter or if you have dandruff or like dry scalp. This is the Tichel from Neutrogena. This one is, we use this like twice or thrice a week and this is the daily one. So for me, I'm all, I always have a dry scalp since I was young. Every time, you know, I always go to Derma just for it. But I finally found something that is available drugstore or anywhere, you know. I think this is, you know, easy to get and I don't think that it's that expensive as like the, what the dermatologist will prescribe you. So this one, you use it, like I said earlier, two to three times a week. And this is the one that you use every day. So if you have a dry scalp, you are usually most likely you will not use conditioner as like me, you know, you will always see my hair dry because every time that I use conditioner, it always gives me, if there's a pimple breakout, I always have a dandruff breakout. Dandruff breakout? Not breakout? What the heck? Breakout. There you go. So that's why I don't like using conditioners, but since I found this bad boy, it saves my life. So thank me later because you will save your life too. And then of course, if it's winter, you need to have a loofah, girl. Don't tell me you don't scrub yourself or exfoliate because that's gross. Well, actually you don't have to do that every day because it's also not good for you, but you need to, you know, do exfoliation at least two to three times a week or if it's winter every other day you know because you don't like that so dry skin showing off so this is the second bathroom as we walk through there you go so as you enter the bathroom the first thing that you will see is this sink which is really nice it's also a gray white brown color theme and my favorite part are the lights it also has the same light as the one that is in downstairs and hey kindle and then, these are mostly just all medical, you know, like medicine thing. There you go. And hand soap, of course. And Christmas tree decoration. There you go. Hello! Just towels. And then, this is the... Since it's winter, this is my favorite body wash, which is Georgian's Hydrating Coconut Oil Infused Body Wash. There you go. This is Anthony. And that's all for today guys. I hope you enjoyed this mini bathroom tour video. If you do, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and click the notification bell so you'll always be notified whenever we upload new chat videos. Thanks so much. Bye for now.